Hello everybody, this is Mr. Rob and welcome back to another channel update where today I'll get you kind of caught up on what's going to be happening in the future with this channel. So we're going to actually be going through a somewhat of a shift in the next couple of months. So I want to get you guys caught up on what's been going on, kind of give you an insight as to what to expect so we are not cut off guard. But so if you're excited for this one, make sure you drop a like and subscribe down below, especially if you want more franchise content. Now, it's been a while since I've done a channel update. Well, it's actually not been overly long. It's been since February 7th, so about a month and a half. And I just kind of wanted to make this. I usually don't like to make channel updates so close together, but this one is important because this channel is going to be going through a change. Now, currently, we have one series going on on the channel, and that is the Toronto Thunderbirds franchise. And what I've been seeing is that Madden NFL 22 is just not bringing in the views currently. You know, viewership has kind of fallen off with the series. It's not getting as much love as, you know, other videos have in the past. So with just football going on, I thought it's time for a little bit of a change. Now, I have hinted at this a little bit. And, you know, if you follow me on Twitter, if you follow, you know, my community tabs, this is something I've thought about for at least a few past few months and I'm finally going to pull the trigger. So, what can you expect going forward on the channel? You should expect to see some WWE 2K22 hitting the channel. Now, a little bit of background as to why I'm doing this. One, I'm a big WWE and wrestling fan. I've been watching since I was about nine years old. I am now 25 years old, so for the past good 16 years give or take like a year or two i've been watching wrestling it's just something i just cannot get out of and i am one of my dream jobs i would say is to be a booker i love you know just the behind the scenes stuff you know thinking about how certain players certain superstars get pushed certain don't and one of my dream jobs that i would like to have would be a booker as to how i book the shows and the current characters i mean i've gone so far as as in the notes in my phone i still make you know fantasy booking decisions with my phone in my free time in terms of like what's going on so i've always been a wwe fan and i think this is just the right time for it football is dropping off there's really nothing coming up in the next couple of months. Well, I'll touch on something momentarily. And the new game just came out. It's the first WWE game in over a year and a half. And I want to take this momentum. And I do think if I do this right, this could help the channel grow. I do want to expand the channel. My goal is to obviously be able to make money off this channel. And I think this is an opportunity. It is a risk because I am stepping into something different. And I know, you know, a lot of my fan base, my loyal you know, subscribers have been watching me through sports. And this isn't necessarily your normal sports, obviously. This is something different. But, you know, I have contemplated this for the past couple months, and I am finally going to pull the trigger. WWE 2K22 on the channel. It's what I want to do, and I do want to make my... I love you guys, but also like to do what's best for me sometimes. And I do think I can branch out and collect a new audience and help grow this channel in the long run. Um, those who don't usually watch WWE here on the channel, I'm sorry. This might not be um, what you're... I'm hoping for but I would like you guys support with this maybe just give it a try even if you're not a big wrestling fan I'd appreciate it. you know if you gave a couple of videos to try help grow the channel spread the word you know I'm doing a WWE 2k you know series which I'll talk more about in a second my main series I'll be doing with this game is a big universe mode series now if you're not sure what universe mode is it's kind of where you just book it like you see it on TV it's going to be a three times a week series now this is why I have just been hesitant is because this series the way I want to do it, it's going to take a lot of time. It's going to take a lot of effort. So I'm going to do three days a week. I'm going to do Monday, Tuesday, Friday, because those are the days that you see it on TV. Monday Night Raw, Tuesday NXT, and then Friday Night SmackDown. Uh, it's going to mirror what you see on WWE. So a lot of the same superstars you see, a lot of the same shows you see. If you've been around the channel for a while, you know this is a realistic channel. You don't see anything that's too far-fetched. So you're not going to see, you know... Stone Cold Steve Austin and The Rock, you know, fighting every single week, fighting Hulk Hogan. This is going to be the superstars that you see of today, mirroring storylines and, you know, curtain, some trajectory that you see on TV. Now, it's not saying that whatever you see on TV is going to be on the channel. I'm definitely going to put my own spin on things, but don't expect some, like, outlandish, like, universe with stars from all eras fighting each other. Now, what does this mean for the channel? Like I said, 2K22 is going to be the main focus as far as the Toronto Thunderbirds going on. 
We are currently in year two. This is actually, this is the first time I've ever said this, this is going to be the last year of the Thunderbirds franchise. It's just, it's falling off, like I said, in viewership. We're a good team. We have a chance of winning the Super Bowl this season. We're actually getting ready to start the playoffs in the next couple of weeks. I had to be careful with myself because I've actually recorded up to the playoffs, so no spoilers. But we are going to make the playoffs. That much is given. And I do think we have a shot at a Super Bowl this year. And this will be the last year in the Toronto Thunderbirds franchise. So, Thunderbirds will be ending. WWE 2K22 will be taking over. Now, that does not mean WWE is the only thing I'm going to be doing. I think this is another reason why I'm doing WWE is this is the perfect time for this. Because there's also MLB The Show 22 coming out. And if you've been following the channel for a while... MLB has been a very successful franchise for me. You know, a lot of you guys like my baseball videos, and I did contemplate if I want to do baseball this year, but I am going to do baseball this year. So expect WWE to be the main focus, and expect MLB The Show 22 to also be a focus. So those two games are what's going to drive us through the summer. There's going to be a lot of WWE coming out, a lot of MLB The Show coming out, because I don't want to completely go away from what's gotten me to this point. And I can kind of use this summer as like a test drive, you know, see how the channel does with WWE, see how the channel does with baseball. If one falls off, I can easily shift to the other. If WWE is just not something that catches on with the channel, then, you know, in the fall you do got Madden and you do got NBA and stuff that comes out. So this is, I think, the perfect time to do this. And all the people who actually commented in my most recent YouTube community tab, thank you. You guys have, you know, done you guys have been great you know you give me suggestions you know talk to me back into doing baseball so i love you guys i also think this is a big chance for me i think the positives outweigh the negatives and i do think you know my heart maybe being a little bit you know leading me a little bit this is just something i want to do so i thank you guys for your understanding i hope you guys like where this is going leave your feedback down below how do you feel about this shift it is definitely a shift because this is the first non-sports thing i'm doing and it's going to be a big deal on the channel uh, also don't forget to vote for the mr rob channel hall of fame i wanted to plug that in there voting ends this friday at 3 p.m we'll see who gets elected to be the first ones into the channel hall of fame i will link that video at the end if you want to see the nominations and the google form will be down in the comments below but like i said you know i don't do this the only reason why i do this is because of you guys i the fact you guys show me the support the fact that we're at 570 subscribers is crazy and i know this channel is going to keep growing so i thank you guys for doing you know just being supportive um universe mode i didn't say this will be starting after wrestlemania as well so don't expect the big series to start until early april for those who don't follow the wwe but expect to see some wwe videos pop out and tomorrow i will have a wwe video it won't be a universe mode but i do want to kind of just start to get ingrown into the game and just maybe capture a little bit of an audience before i introduce the big series but i thank you guys so much for listening to this i hope you guys enjoyed this episode hope you guys are enjoying the channel let me know like i said earlier in the comment section what do you guys think how are some suggestions you might have but make sure you leave a like and subscribe down below especially if you want more franchise content this is mr rob and i'll see you in the next one